This is the Waffle Bros, I'm Corwin. And I'm Uko. And we are back with more Chop Goblins, picking up where we left off, heading into the final level. Also, I have no ammo. I have no ammo. Actually, I have a little bit of ammo. I have no ammo, and I must cream um, um they have lightsabers they have lightsabers and they're wearing some sort of like bondage gear that's kind of what it looks like to me yeah that's kind of what it looks like to me bondage jedi bondage jedi and then they're like because you know they 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 can't um they can't yell obscenities at you because they have uh they have gags in their mouths that's oh. what they have and i don't know why Darth i think I think my saying that made Uko gag. Ooh, no, I got I was, some wand uh, charges. Wand charges in the face. No, no, no. Bad goblin, no lightsaber. Wait, bad goblin sounds like some sort of bad dragon type of thing. <laughs> <laughs> Whip it out, you bad goblin over here. You know. I don't want to hear about that nonsense. Like, two things. First of all, uh, goblins should not be allowed to have lightsabers. No, two, no, they shouldn't. Two, um, I think the reason I coughed is because I was trying to make, uh, like Darth Vader breathing noises. And then maybe also goblin noises at the same time, and that yeah. just doesn't make a lick of sense. It doesn't work at the fuck all. Um, um, they have, like, they don't have lightsabers. They have they light have cleavers. Light cleavers. <laughs> that, honestly, that it's sounds pretty cool. pretty cool. Now, you know, I will say once again... Um, this looks like a quake level suddenly. It suddenly has a very quake, like disco quake kind of vibe quake going drawn. on here. There's like levels in Quake 2 that look very, very much like this. I should probably just be wanding these motherfuckers in the face. There we freaking go. Oh yes, yeah. suck my wand, bitches. You know the way they suck use... my Hitachi magic wand this thing's more like a hitachi tragic wand though <laughs> you don't want this near your anywhere crotch. near your bits no thank you the way they're using the uh light cleavers it's like they really want them to be the most forbidden weapon the uh lightsaber nunchucks light nunchaku none, i agree with none that. can use them because <laughs> like you'd have to grab the end of the lightsaber well you know when you said none can use them it made me think about nuns using, using lightsabers lightsabers that nuns might be blasphemous lightsabers uh it's uh, also might be someone's kink and um oh my yeah that's uh and like I, I, i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna like you know forewarn everyone here this weird story i'm about to tell has nothing to do with bestiality, really, before I say it, right? Don't. But the qualifier I, made me terrified. Yeah, yeah, I know. But I remember, I remember, um, like, back in the 90s when, you know, uh, pornographic images were first surfacing on the internet. And there seemed to be this one website that was dedicated to nothing but women dressed as nuns, naked next to horses like they weren't doing anything with the horses they were so just, you're saying they wore just like the head part of the nun costume and like, they were standing next to a horse they wore like the head part plus some you know it wasn't but like they, but they were exposed too. they were exposed yeah and it was Wait just, a minute i think i saw i do remember seeing one of these images yeah because the one that i saw and tell me if i'm if my brain is just making this up it was most of the nun outfit, but it was the tit part was cut out. Yeah, something like that. Something like that. Oh, in the face. That's really weird, yo. Yeah, I know. And I'm like, back then, it was just like you kind of had to just take what you got, you know? Yeah, you're right. You're right. That's how early in the internet experience this was. Yeah. That it was like, this is definitely not made for me, but it's the nudity that I have. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> I'm not a Catholic. I ain't got anything for nuns, but... <laughs> It's right here. It's, it's right here. What it is? Um, are they up there throwing their fucking like lightsabers at me? Not cool, bro. Oh, okay, look at Savage Press over here. <laughs> <laughs> look, Savage Press hit the gym, man. I I'll be, I'll be real. They were being oppressed by being in the like Chop Goblin, um, like container that we allowed them out of. So, yeah, oh, also, this if room, they mad, it's probably for good reason. This room kind of looked like the room where Qui-Gon Jinn got killed. Yeah, uh, except in the sense... Oh, oh, you mean this room over here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's like some sort of 
space reactor, oh, all space reactor, and her uh, space will react if you know Yo, what okay, I mean. Yo, okay, hold on a minute. How come they never sold Qui-Gon Jinn? Oh, I mean, they did, you know, when Fallout 4 came out, they sold, or Fallout 76, I'm not sure which one, they sold, like, Nuka-Cola at Target, and we weren't able to get our hands on any that disappointed me. Dude, it would have been so cool to make, like, Nuka vodka drink, like, mixers. Nuka mixers? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm with it. Or at least use um, it as a Nuka chaser. Wait, wait. This is where I get tech support from. All these guys were doing their tech support. It's this is just evil enough to be like where you get tech support have from. You, have you tried installing all the updates? <laughs> have you tried restarting? <laughs> <laughs> I made it real evil. Like yeah. seriously. Yeah, it's like so evil that you want to eat your own lips. <laughs> that's uh, <laughs> That's how evil you fucking went. Wait a minute, I don't have here. the sound on. Are the are the cleavers making vroom, vroom, vroom noises? Not really. So That's you don't sad. have to feel like you're missing out in that regard. Yeah, yeah. I, I love how to you that's sad. <laughs> it's a well, maybe it's not a missed opportunity. Maybe it's more of like a copyright thing. Mm, I'm pretty sure if you want to make like um holy sh holy shit, they're cornholing me. And I I actually died. I actually fucking died. We'll be right back. This time I will not underestimate these fuckers of mothers over here. You stay Juicy. away from me, um, you nasty that, son of a bitch. That meat chunk was vaguely threatening. Meat chunk, dirty meat chunk, meat chunk, baby. Are you saying goblin meat is not fit for human consumption? Um, probably not, no. I don't, I don't consider it cannibalism. Uh, it's not cannibalism, it's just probably like, Greedy. Tainted with Satan's anus or something like that. You know, you know what I mean. As previously <laughs> noted, like real greasy, like school fajitas. <laughs> yes. I'm yes. telling you. Have I told the story? I don't remember if I have. About the first time I got heartburn was from uh, crappy, low quality elementary school fajitas, <laughs> and I thought I was dying. Like, I that's really funny. I oh shit! Like, oh I, shit! I, I didn't, I didn't know what was wrong with me. And they were like, 20 or 30 seconds, I thought I was going to have to, like, get somebody. And, like, because, <laughs> like, I, I thought I was having a heart attack or something. And then I realized this what this is what must, this is what people must mean when they say heartburn. Because it burns your heart. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I, I, I dig what What's you're saying over here. It was, they weren't, they didn't taste horrible because probably they were so incredibly greasy. Um, um. Goblin, um. I, I destroyed Tron. the Cyber Goblin to set things right. Uh, cool. The Cyber cool. Goblin was the problem? The Cyber Goblin was the friends we made along the way. You emerge <laughs> gasping from the time portal back in the museum <laughs> basement. Your own time, just as you'd left it. But what of the Chop Goblins? You gl glance frantically out the window. The city streets are miraculously <laughs> undestroyed and unchopped. The nightmare is over. Then your eye catches something in the corner. The dusty old chest that had imprisoned the Chop Goblins is still there, and still open. The Chop Goblins are out there somewhere, waiting for the opportunity to chop again. Well, that's ominous. Cool! I mean... I'm stoked. Hells to the fucking yes! That please, was awesome. Please make Chop Goblins 2 the re -choppening. I agree. I agree. But... We're gonna stop here. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that schmexa thumbs up button. Make sure you ring the bell to keep getting notified of delicious waffle content. Waffle Bros signing out.